Hello. Let's solve this together. Root x over 3x equals 3. This is very simple because I can express this. You know, I can cross multiply this. So that root x times 1 is root x and is equal to 3 multiplied by 3x. Now root x is equal to 9x. From what do I do? Root x has to be squared and it's equal to 9x, which will also be squared. Now this go there, this goes there, so we have x to be equal to 9x multiply by 9x because of the square there. Now our x is going to be 81x squared. The one with the highest power comes first. So we're going to have our 81x squared to be equal to x. Now to avoid dividing both sides by x, bring this to the left. So we have 81x squared minus x to be equal to 0. Now we can factorize and x is a common factor but there is still one x here minus 1 because x divided by x is 1 then we equate to 0. Now we are multiplying this term and this term to get 0. So it's either x is 0 or it's 1 minus Okay, it's a 1x, it's a 1x minus 1 is equal to 0. Our x here remains 0, or it's a 1x is equal to 1. Take minus 1 to the other side, and it becomes positive 1. Now, our x is 0, or x from here will be 1 divided by 81. So that way, okay, we have 1 over 81, right? So that way, um, x will be alone, right? Now, let's bring the two solutions together. x is 0 or 1 over 81. But then, do you think the both of them will satisfy the equation? Let's verify. Okay, so our x, okay, the equation is root x over 3x equals 3. Now, if you put in 0 here, it means that you have root 0 over 3 times 0. And at the end of the day, we have um, 0 over 0, and this cannot give 3. So this value of x is rejected. Now, we work with the next value. Square root of x becomes square root of 1 over 81. Then the whole of this is divided by 3 times x, which will be 3 times 1 over 81, because x is 81, 1 over 81. And this implies that we have square root of 1 over 81 divided by um, 3 will go into... 81, 27 times. So we're having 1 over 27. Now you can rearrange this, or better still find the square root of 1 and 81. Square root of 1 is 1 divided by square root of 81 is 9. Then this division is coming here. Then we have 1 over 27. This give this will give us 1 over 9. Multiply by 27 over 1. So that at the end of the day, we have 27 times 1, 27 over 9 times 1, 9. And when you divide 27 by 9, you have 3. Remember, the equation is square root of x over 3x equals 3. Right? So this means that we are very correct to say that our x is 1 over over 81 and not x equals 0. This is rejected. This satisfies. Thank you for watching. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, 
subscribe.